Okay, so the rundown for today. Bags are full of cans. I get cast aluminum. Some, I don't know if they're classified as low copper. That's what I get at the other yard, but we're going to find out. There's a little bit of extrusion, some steel. Uh, low motors are in that bucket there. Some clean cast. This would be dirty cast, but we'll see what they classify it as. Like I said, they have a shredder, so they classify it differently. This here is full of steel, which I don't want because the barrel's like, oh. So they can keep the barrel when I throw it off. Um, what else did I throw on there? There's no copper, there's no brass, uh, but I needed to clean these cans up because they're just all over in my shop and I bagged them up today and there's probably still at least another couple bags still in the shop, but I'm going to get rid of these ones today anyhow just to get rid of them. I think the price of cans are 47 cents, I think. We'll find it for sure today and we'll find out what everything else is. Just It's just to get this, this mess cleaned up because I needed, like I said, I need to get rid of as much as I possibly can right now. So there you go. And of course... I'll show you. The mechanic's out again today. She's working on her car. Sass is down there working on her car. She's putting new uh, new brakes and rotors on her uh, her car. So, and I don't know if she's got to loop anything else up today or not. I guess we'll find out, but we're gonna head. <laughs> That's it, bend over there, Sass. Oh, there you go. <laughs> She even spanked it for you. <laughs> oh, such a bad girl. All right, so we're gonna be heading. Oh, this is at my window or my uh, furnace place. Look what they left me. Oh, that was nice. Look what else is down in here. Oh. Awesome. So I'll get this loaded. Okay, so I got three more cleaners to do clean. I got to take the motors off them. And I got some more wire and some more goodies in there. Another piece of cast is clean. So I got to go through that and see what's in there. But there's a bunch of wire in there. And another cord on this one. And this worked up at the front. So. Oh, I got to get that off. That is goopy. That right there is goopy. Oh, you get it off. But anyhow. This is how they play. And they play for hours. Only when I'm home, though. They don't usually, like, usually when I'm not home, I guess they sit at the door while um, the collie does, which is Molly. Molly sits usually at the door waiting for me to come home, unless there's someone else here. When my mom is just here, or whatever, or, say, or April stays here, or somebody's here, then they, you know, they give attention to them. They just love attention, these two. So they just, I don't know, they like to uh, be around somebody. But uh, they're happy when I'm home. This is what they do. They like to play for hours and hours and hours. So. But, there they go. They're just playing for hours, enjoying themselves. <laughs> oh, they're silly. Now be gentle, guys. Be nice now. Play nice. You're getting a little rough, I think. One of these are going to go yipe in a minute. You're getting a little too carried away. Be nice, Angel. Be nice. Angel, play nice. Angel's definitely the more dominant one, where uh, Molly's more passive. But she does give it to her once in a while. When uh, Angel gets out of control, Molly will give it to her. So, just to tell her, like, I don't know, bugger. But here she comes. Come here. Come on. Oh, here we go. Jealousy. Come here. Come here. Angel. Angel. Angel, stop. Stop, okay? You don't need to be biting on her ears. Stop biting on her ears, okay? Hey, stop biting on her ears. Angel, stop biting on her ears. And the other one's trying to climb up. Pretty soon they're going to have them both in my lap here. And if you know that, I guess not. They're going to take off, which is good. But that's it. They're just playing like they always do. They do this in the morning if I get up when I'm having my tea and sitting and chill and wait for a bit um usually waiting for april to get up and uh they usually play like this and i let them out in the mornings of course and they go outside and they they play around i have to leave uh angel on a leash though because if i don't she takes off molly i can let her go outside and run around she's all right she doesn't go far she always looks for a ball so she's got like three or four of them out on the lawn which i have to watch when i go to cut it which i'm gonna have to do very soon apparently the lawn is turning green so my first barbecue will be coming up um, next month. 
So that should be fun with a bunch of family and friends. So, but there's my babies. They're just playing like they always do. They're so cute. My babies are so cute. Angel, she got to go out a little bit when I went home because I had to take uh, my niece's truck home to her, and uh, I went over to get my car. So I've had a long day. So been out all day getting out at stuff and cleaning stuff at the barn and the shop and trying to put stuff away. But there they are, they're playing. I'm going to let you go because I'm getting tired. My baby. <laughs> She's always happy to see me. She's always happy. Here comes the other one. Here comes the other one. <laughs> All right, girls. Give me a minute. <laughs> All right, you two, see? I didn't go play. All right, so they're playing. I'm going to see if I can get through my ticket for today. For the love of guys. All right, well, they're playing. I'll see if I can get through the ticket. All right, so I cleaned some more up in the yard. I had 220 pounds, still $185 a ton, so I had $20.35 just for uh, shred steel. Okay, so then I had a couple pieces of extrusion that was up there by the shop. It was, uh, I think, three pieces of it. So I had 65 cents a pound, I had eight pounds of it, so it was $5.20. Um, then I had some more electric motors I found up there in the shop. It was 30 pounds of them, which is 23 cents a pound at $6.90. So then I had some of that cast aluminum I said was dirty. Well, apparently in there, it's not dirty. It was marked as clean. So I had 56 pounds of it, which I don't mind. 45 cents a pound. So I had $25.20. So that's pretty good. Then I had some other stuff, which they call MSLC, which is low copper. So I had four pounds of it. It was just like tubing stuff. So I got rid of it, and I got 55 cents a pound for two twenty. Got rid of it. Didn't need it. All right, so then I had these pop cans. Oh, my God, I got pop cans up there in the shop that I'm trying to get rid of. I had 40 pounds. I think it was like two or three bags of them. They weren't squashed. I just threw them in the bags just to get rid of them. So I got 50 cents a pound, so I got $20 just for a couple bags of cans. So that wasn't bad. So today's payday was $79.85, and they're still horsing around, as you guys can see. This is what they do every day. In the morning, the afternoon, doesn't matter if I'm in the here, if I'm in the living room with them or in the kitchen, this is what they do. They horse around because they know I'm home. But anyhow, I have to get back to my ticket. So today's was exactly $79.85, almost 80 bucks for today, just for pretty much, um, just odds and ends it was around. I threw in containers just to get rid of it to make more space. I'm still trying to clean up. Hopefully, I can get a couple more loads to get out and get rid of. But anyhow, just to give you that... Uh, the look see of today's so but that was it for today it was just one load um i had some more cleaning up in the in the shop up there to do and my friend was out today again working on her car she was putting her uh rotors and her brakes on the the back of her car she finally got them done and uh she's content she's actually a, um, a mechanic but she's uh She's kind of not wanting to do it anymore, so she's looking into doing something else. Um, I'm sure you'll see her in future videos. Um, she's one of my good friends. But anyhow, so that's it for today. So hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, give me a thumbs up. And if you're new, please subscribe and uh, share. Please share. Um, thank you for watching.